frigid coniferous forests taiga region taiga is a russian word for marshy pine forest this region has the coniferous forests of the north as it's very cold here there is not a large variety of plant life these are evergreens which means they don't shed their leaves all at once the soil here is not very fertile and the ground freezes in winter the trees save energy by keeping their leaves the leaves are like needles so they don't lose water the tree shape is like a cone so the snow slides off that way the snow can't pile up and break the branches as it's so cold there aren't too many animals in the taiga region some animals hibernate when the temperatures drop some animals have an extra layer of feathers or fur to bear the cold some animals change the color of their fur when the season changes to blend with the surroundings Here are some animals in this region. Ermine, lemming, brown bear, lynx. Higher above the taiga is the tundra region. Tundra in the language of Finland means plain without trees. The tundra has long cold winters and short cool summers the ground is permanently frozen not even plant roots can dig into it here are some tundra animals snowy owl arctic tern arctic hare reindeer arctic fox alpine tundra A region that has no trees because of its high altitude is called alpine tundra. The plants and animals vary depending on where the region is and what latitude and altitude it's at. Poles. The Arctic and Antarctica are frozen ice caps that have temperatures below freezing throughout the year. Hardly any animals or plants are found here. Mostly animals migrate to warmer regions. Few animals can stand this terribly cold climate. Here are some animals found here. Snow petrel, emperor penguin, antarctic fur seal. Think and discuss. Why do animals in the polar region have thick fur? and thick skin what is an alpine tundra